everybody, Colleen here from Colleen Beauty and Fashion. So, it's been a minute since I made a video, so thank you for hanging in there. If you're one of the subscribers that stuck with me through the last few weeks, thank you. I appreciate you. It's been a crazy life right now. If you're new to my channel, I did a video about a month ago, I guess, about moving, and then I got a new puppy, and I have a new job, a relatively new job. So. Lots going on, so I wasn't able to make a video for a couple weeks, but I'm back. And I'm happy and excited to share with you the latest Sephora Minis collection I have. I love minis. People who watch my channel, the makeup part, know that I love Sephora Minis. So, I have a new one. So, let's get into it. Here we go. So, this one is called the Fresh Face Kit. There it is. And this one had quite a few things in it that I really wanted to try. So I'm really excited about it. So I'm going to open it up. It's like Christmas when I do this. I love doing this. And I'm going to just reach in and pull the first thing out, which is... I need my glasses. <laughs> it is... The Dr. Bronzy Anti-Pollution sunshine drops from drunk elephant so i have never tried anything from drunk elephant these are bronzing drops so i'm super excited about that this is what they look like now let's see if i can get them open that's always the trick for me oh there we go that was pretty easy nice little pump and if you haven't watched me before what i love about sephora's minis is you get to try things that are quite expensive sometimes Try them out before you actually buy a full size because what if you don't like it? So I think it's a brilliant concept. I've done this many times. It took a few pumps to get going, but there it is. Beautiful bronzing drops. And I'm assuming you could mix that into your foundation or just a moisturizer or sunscreen maybe. Just use that, which would be a great option in the in the summertime, we might see. Not bad, not bad. So I'll try it later and I'll let you know what I think. But it is, once you get it rubbed out, it's quite nice. And I think I would mix it with a little bit of foundation. That's how I would use it. So let's see what we have next in here. And don't forget, I know you can tell, but I have mature skin. So my reviews are going to be mostly what works on my skin. I'm 61 years old. I have dry skin. As you can see, I have wrinkles and brown lines and all this lovely loveliness that comes with aging. And the only ones I don't really mind are my crow's feet because they look happy to me. But I can do without these guys. <laughs> anyway, this is Danessa Mayricks. And I was really excited to try this. My daughter turned me on to Danessa Mayricks and all her loveliness. Here's the little box. Now this is the Yummy Skin Blurring Balm Powder for face and eyes. So let's see, and the shade is Universal, which is universal for everybody. I think my daughter got this. I was with her, I think I bought it for, for her birthday, as a matter of fact. There's the very pretty little case, and I think you, Unscrew it. Is that right? Yes. So there's the balm. So let's give it a little try. When I was with her in the store, it was just like kind of a gleamy, glowy kind of a thing. I'm not even sure you'll be able to see it, but there it is on my hand. I'm filming this at night, so I may need to do it during the day. Try it out during the day so you can see it better. But I'm just going to put this one here for now. It is lovely in texture, that's for sure. So, it says for, so there we go. I'll try this some more and I'll let you know what I think. Hopefully at the end of the month. There's the Denise Mayricks. So, lovely. Okay. No smell. Doesn't have any smell. So, let's reach in here and see what we get next. This is Tarts. What else is again? 
charts, lights, camera, lashes. Look at this fabulous. Like this is really cool. It's got kind of a leather, a leather covering to it. Can you see? Snakeskin, I guess. That's what it would be. And here's the brush. I'm not going to try this today because I already have mascara on, but I will. Oh, I like the brush. That's nice. Nice black. So I'll definitely try that tomorrow. So that's really impressive. I like that a lot. And next we have, this is the Iconic London. Get the name right. Uh, Prep, Set, and Glow. I shook it up. Now it's all bubbly. <laughs> so I did want to try this one too because I heard good things about this as either a primer or what I'm going to use it for is a setting spray. It's the pump. Very nice. It's a little bit of a fragrance. So here we go. Oh, it smells like a little bit like hairspray. Like a really good hairspray my mom used to back in the 60s. Isn't that weird how your sense of smell can just bring something back to you right like that? So there's the glowy spray on and I will have a look and I'll try it again later but so far I like that. It had a really good nice spray, nice even spray, not too heavy. So next we have, next we have the Huda Beauty eyeliner. This one says very brown and there's the tip. You can see it's supposed to be long lasting. So let me just, there we go. Nice, soft, soft line. And it looks like you can probably blend it a bit. Yeah. So that's what I really like. I'm excited to try this because I'm always in search of a good brown eyeliner, especially when I can tight line with, because that's an issue for me. They always disappear. The next we have, this is Rare Beauty. And I love these little blushes. They last forever. So honestly, all you need is a little one. Like you don't need the big one. I bought the big one in um, Believe. Belief or Believe, one of the two. And uh, it, it'll last me a lifetime for sure. But I also have the one Joy, which is a pretty peachy orange color in this size. And this one is pink. So I thought it'd be nice to have it. It's the color. I'll put a little dot on my hand for you. See, just a really nice, vibrant pink for summer. I love pink cheeks in summer. So this is called Happy. Cute name. Let's blend it out a little bit. Yeah, look at how pigmented these are. You have to be so careful. But that's why they last so long. So, yeah. I'm not going to put it on right now because I have blush on. Yeah, isn't that pretty? That'll be really pretty for summer. Now this is by Mario. Okay, I've never, again, another thing I've never had is any makeup by Mario. So this one is, I think it's a lip balm. Let me just see. Uh, pink Glow. Yeah, it says Plumping Lip Serum. Oh, I didn't realize it was a serum. Okay, so there it is. It's very pretty, light color. Oh, you hear the click? So let's click it a little bit. I'll do it, maybe I'll do it on my other hand. Can you see? Just a little, hard to see on there. But it does have a, just a tiny, tiny flush of pink on it. Otherwise, a lip balm. And I always need these, so I'm really excited about that. Mmm. Got a great balmy texture for sure. You can feel a little bit of the mint plumper in it. So, very nice though. I like that. Oh, and we're down to the last thing, which is the Too Faced Lip Injection, Lip, Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme Lip Shaper Plumping Lip Liner in Puffy Nude. So let's have a look. Sure. So there's the color which is quite nice, nice pinky nude. I'm not gonna use it right now because I just put all that on, but there's how it looks once I clicked it up a little bit. So I'll try that out on another day and let you know how it works. Okay, so 
<laughs> this is Maggie. This is only her second time on camera. Do I look at the camera, baby? Look, look. See, over here. There you go. Yeah, so <laughs> we're going to say bye-bye now. I want to thank you for watching the video. Please, if you're new to my channel and this is your first video, please look around and if you like it, please subscribe. Say bye-bye now until the next time. Okay, ready? This is the bye-bye part. Bye-bye, everybody.